no matter what, College Football 25 is going to be legendary, record-breaking. It's going to be the biggest moment in sports gaming in probably the last decade. But let's be focused here. Let's talk about some of the little bits and pieces and things and tricks that EA is trying to get you with. I mean, you see Travis Hunter as the number one wide receiver, Shador Sanders at, with 98 awareness, ranked as, I think, one or two quarterbacks in all of college football. Look, I understand. This is just video games. I get it. But we are seeing EA purposely use these individuals as clickbait, the teams, the players, and all the situations. It's great marketing. It's elite marketing, actually. And I, I kind of want to see it play out a little further. So we're going to check a look at some of these ratings and see how nasty it can get. But EA is setting up a lot of these teams for failure we know ea is slobbering on colorado as well but is that even a good thing for them i don't think so dog ladies and gentlemen um i just want you to know uh, i i wake up with hot flashes thinking of being able to play college football 25 i went and bought an xbox because it's not on pc that's a separate video because all oh, it's coming don't you worry about it um and i literally don't want to do anything else on this thing i d i don't i think it's gross uh the fact that it looks like an xbox one still um it's it's a pack of it's two packs of grass dog um drop the g in the r and you need to see what i'm saying uh yeah i i i'm 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 itching right now so anything i can do to kind of feed this itching going on this is what we're going to do so the rankings have dropped today the official ratings for the, at least the top 100 players so i think we need to have some conversations about it before i even get to it the colorado absolute schlobbering um cock manchin if you will um it, i told y'all it was happening before when the the team rankings came out and we're gonna have a separate video on that because it, it's a little bit ridiculous it's a, it's a little bit insane i, I think <clears throat> this is what i'll do i'll separate them into two uh, i'm gonna do a travis video and then i'll do a shador video but this is gonna be about colorado again ea is using Colorado as a pawn, as engagement bait. They know exactly what they're doing. They know that putting Travis Hunter as the best wide receiver in all of college football, again, it's just a game. We get it, dog. I understand. But if you're thinking that in this uh, wildly anticipated game that people have been waiting for 10 years, uh, you know you have a lackluster product in Madden, and we're coming over to this game, and we're, we're seeing all this attention to detail, and all and, oh, the places and spaces, and, and oh my goodness, and, and the crowd is perfect. And you saw how Donovan Evers was running for a touchdown, and the crowd changed. It was crazy. Just for... And I apologize, there is, you know, NCAA 14 gameplay in the background. You can't use college football 25 gameplay um, like from them, from from EA. You will get struck and you will get demonetized. I can't get into that. But just enjoy it, dog. Um, we see all this attention to detail when it comes to presentation and, you know, uh, the drip, you know, red shirting the intricacies of college football a lot of these big questions that we were asking especially because how much college football has changed in these last 10 years right transfer portal nil this that and the other thing uniforms god i love these uniforms um but with all that being said I i'm just saying they knew what they were doing see and, and this is how i know what they were they, they knew what they were doing because the top five the top five players those all make sense those 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 make a decent amount of sense. Yeah. Will Johnson has already been pretty Will Johnson would have would have gone top ten if he went out the draft last year and kids is not even eligible. Um being compared to Patrick Sertain, fluid, a beast, elite technique. I mean, just check the box. He can play physical. He was on a uh, I mean an elite defense, went to the night twice. I mean like what else do you want? He's an easy, yeah, brother. Give me give me the best cornerback prospect out of the last three to five years. And which is even crazier that the, one of the best <laughs> cornerback prospects, they're like prospects, uh, in the last three to five years is number one. And then just five spots underneath is Travis Hunter, who by all regard is an elite athlete, an absurd athlete. If we were ranking athletes, dog. Um, I should try to run him. number one, like the things that he can do hit, hit with his body, the things that he can do, uh, like I said, body control, pause, uh, things he can do with his body, the things that, you know, the speed, the eliteness, things he can do with his hands. The, I mean, uh, being able to, the, even the football skill is 
absurdly elite. Go watch that. I'm just going to keep saying it. Y'all have seen the TCU interception. That is a technique. They, as much as it looks like when you're watching, it, it looks like just a freak. Oh, he jumped off and, and jumped up. That, that was all technique, and that's the scariest thing about him. This dude's savvy. I think, personally, he's a better cornerback than he is a wide receiver. So the fact seeing him up there, like, I don't know what we're talking about. Will Campbell, obviously, is going to be, uh, you know, one of the left tackles, big bad dog, LSU, SEC lineman. I don't know what else you want me to tell you. The dog can move bodies. Ollie Gordon, I mean, seems to be the Heisman favorite coming into this year. Um, absolute dog of a running back james pierce and this is again this is one of those like okay so y'all were paying attention james pierce jr is not just like if you're not watching football you wouldn't know james pierce jr is like prospect uh, like a, a, a potential number one pick coming into this draft you know six what is he six four six five just a big lanky long comparisons to miles garrett that type of guy he's so big he, he has the production. No one can block him right now. A little undersized, but, you know, he'll when, when he gets up to the league, you expect that to happen. That makes sense for his ability, what it means in college football. That makes sense for him to be top five. Caleb Downs is was the best safety in college football last year as a true freshman. There's nothing else I need. Wait, wait. <laughs> a true freshman starting at Alabama. That's all I need to say. A, a true freshman safety starting at Alabama. He was, I don't want to say best defensive back because Terry and Arnold and Kool-Aid McKissie were some, were some, they were some cornerbacks, dog. But uh, probably the best safety in the in the whole goddamn nation when it comes to Caleb Williams. Top five solidified. Easy peasy, lemon squeeze. And then we get to Travis Hunter and that as a cornerback, as a wide receiver. Okay, fine. Then we get to Malachi Starks. An elite safety. Another potential top 15, top 20 pick. Mason Graham. The best interior defensive tackle in the league. Number eight? Mason Graham's a dog. <laughs> Mason, Mason Graham is a problem. He looks like a pro out there. I, I be, I, I, whenever I see film of him like pop up, I'm like, oh, yeah, I remember uh, that 2016 game. I was like, oh, that's not. That isn't a, a a classic Michigan game. Not not classic, but you know, like a few years back when they had like another set of crazy def interior defensive linemen. I'm like, oh no, this is another dude that they're just it's shitting out. That's that's great. I don't even like. If I'm being honest with you, I don't like Quinston Qu Quinston Quinchin Quinchin Junskin. I swear it wasn't pronounced like this. I don't like Judkins number at top ten. All right. And only and solely because uh, we saw that downtick in production last season. Um, but. I, I I just don't I just have uh, I just I just have no idea I have no idea man but speaking more solely on the Colorado problem and effect though let's let, let's uh let's 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 take another step there right we, I said I said I was gonna have two separate videos I don't care if I said I was gonna make this about Colorado I made that section about Colorado but I'm a dweeb, so let's take a pick. Let's 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 check these out, right? I made my point about certain players being used as that. I'm gonna have my own spiel on on Shador. Have my own spiel on Travis. I think they deserve it, right? But looking further, looking deeper, and taking another step, let's check out these. Like, let's just check it out, man. I'm hungry for this game, dog. So let's let's go through this, right? Um, and, and the craziness is when we get out of the top 10, right? Because they thought they could hide everything else. You know, all right, boom, boom, bada, bing. Okay, so Carson Beck and Shador Sanders are the same rank. Oh, okay. I don't like this. I don't like this. And this is going to be this, 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 um, this is going to be a whole different thing. Yeah, because now, see, I got to do a Travis Hunter video just because of that. But this is, this is crazy. This is crazy. I'm not even going to, I'm going to stop talking about the car. I talked about, Colorado as a whole. I talked about them being used as a pawn. Shador deserves his own video. Like Travis deserves his own video because this is it's crazy, dog. Um, I mean, Imeki. Dog, Imeki. Okay. This dude's a dog. This dude's a dog. Uh, Michael Williams, uh, Deion Walker, Amari Hampton, Trevon Henderson. Uh, I, th I think that's too high for Trevon Henderson. Don't you ask me. Um, Aaron, Aaron, Ursi, Jason Ott. I'm actually not familiar with this gentleman. I need to. I need to. See it up. Quinn Yours at there, 92. I think Quinn Yours is, is rated too high. And and I am a University of Texas fan. Quinn Yours has this thing where he just randomly takes a play to just absolutely I just, I don't want to say any bad words, but he just loses his mind uh, uh, occasionally and, and just is out there playing like uh uh I don't know. I'm trying to think of a bum quarterback. 
I don't know. The decision making after we get, you know, three susceptible great passes is just, I don't know. The inconsistency just scares me. But the kid can spin it. The kid throws one of the most beautiful balls in all of college football. The placement, um, good anticipation, uh, you know, doesn't have the biggest cannon in the world, but he can get it where he needs to get it, how he needs to get it, the, the time he needs to get it. I, to be honest with you, taking a big step and take a look at the leap at this, I'm not mad at a lot of these names. Tor this is the craziest thing, though. This is, and this goes back to the Colorado situation, and I and I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. Tor Tory Horton, I, I think Tory Horton is like 6'4". Absolute demon of a, of a, of a, let me, let me, because I, I, I don't want to get, I don't want to get misspoken here. I don't want to, let, let me see measurable i just, I just want to see his measurable dog this guy okay sorry six two so i said six three six two he's a graduate student from fresno california dog is a beast long arms can, can go out there and get it is is nasty at the point of attack like i just i i i just we we, we need more recognition this top five makes sense i'm not mad at this top five i see what you did with the top five and, and it can, it can it, oh whoa remix it can even be argued um that even having james pierce is high because i mean he is more of a like i said he'd be a top 10 pick so was trayvon walker and he would he wouldn't he wasn't a productive guy right he just he did he did good things he did great things but he wasn't a top tier oh my god he's got 77 tight he's breaking record i mean then again he's on georgia defense that's that's not the point that's besides the point but i, I can even argue this is a bit of marketing use i can i can i can argue having a, the potential heisman uh winner uh the former uh what's it called champion uh one of the most well-known names i just I, I i can see it in a lot of different ways but what i do want to say is that at the end of the day, yeah, he didn't do that bad. Okay, like I, I get it. I see. I can see where they were trying to pull some strings, and and I would see that. But hey, man, I think I think EA didn't do the worst that they could. Um, it's not great, but you know, on EA standards, I think they did okay. But I appreciate you popping in here, joining us, man. I hope you be amazing. I hope you be great. Um, I, I hope you keep it breezy and easy and beautiful. No cover girl. Um, and you know, leave a like this video if you like it, just like if you didn't like it. We'll be having daily college football 25 videos out when it drops. That means the 15th, I guess. Now that the, the dates change, I don't even know. I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be a wire right there at the 15th, 4 p.m., just in case. Just in case. So, y'all be on the lookout, man. Y'all be blessed. Y'all be easy. Y'all be breezy. See y'all next time.